Today we're building a walkway for this customer. He wants a small walkway. It's 95 square foot walkway. And he has it formed and he has a gravel, wire mesh, everything ready to go. We just had to go there and pour the concrete to place it and finish it. This job in East Vancouver and this job is very close to the door so we didn't need a pump there. We just had to shoot it. The concrete truck back there and the shoot reaches so we're good to go. And basically he just fill in all the area where it's formed with concrete then he's screeding it. While he's screeding this job he doesn't have to use a lot of skills because this is this screeding for this job is a little bit easier because he's when he screeds he just makes sure it's the level of the form so he goes over the forms and the one who formed it the carpenter he made sure it's slopped properly to make sure the water goes away from the house and now we have a little bit extra concrete as you see the customer told us to put it on the side because he need this area um, kind of more solid because he wanted to put something there so we just put it aside but we didn't have to finish it now he's screening lost a little bit and that's how it looks like when it's screed then he using this tool called the mag and he's magging it then th this looks like a broom it's a buffalo and he's buffalo in it the purpose of the buffalo to make sure it's a flat kind of ensure it's a flat and if there's gaps, sometimes it's kind of cover the gaps as well. But like he's got to smooth it again. But the buffalo, it helps with, with the flat in it. So that's why he used the buffalo to flat it if he saw areas. But he goes over the buffalo in each job. Then he left it around for 45 minutes to dry out. And after he left it for 45 minutes to dry out, he grabbed the edger. To, to take care of the edges so f he started with edging it this is the first stage of finishing it because he finished placing and now he's finishing it so he's doing the edges going over the edges each edge to make sure all the edges has been done properly and all the edges are round nothing sharp so if you see like the last edge last little bit he couldn't reach it so he's just jumping over the neighbor's fence and now he reach it we're good to go now he edge it all and last thing he's gonna do before he brooms it he needs to do the cuts and with this cuts you don't need to use a string line basically it's very small so you could use just the screed itself or any straight object to kind of make sure it lines it straight because you want the lines straight and now we'll stop with this a break what? watch the full video and subscribe to my channel or I demolish your driveway <laughs> I think you should subscribe because he looks serious and you don't want him to demolish the driveway. Anyways, now he's finishing this last little bit of the job and what he's doing now, he's smoothing it, making sure there's no gaps in the slab. All the gaps are closed and it looks smooth. So you see like he's just doing extra shining, like it looks shiny, it looks like smooth slab at the moment, but he's doing it like just extra then he's gonna broom it when he broom it if you see all the edges and all the cuts it's kind of hidden now so he will just have to go over them one more time and this time is gonna be the last stage so he's gonna go one more time over the edges usually the neighbors are nice they let us walk in their house most of the neighbors, I don't remember anybody uh, had any objection against that. We just walk in their houses when we do their neighbors, like, they kind of understand. The houses in East Vancouver is a little bit smaller, so this is almost similar to the standard 90 or like 100 square feet uh, walkway. We get a lot of this in that area.
like when you go to other cities west vancouver Kitsilano, you get bigger spaces and most jobs there five six thousand square foot Coquitlam, maple ridge like around two thousand or fifteen hundred square foot but in vancouver most of the jobs we get around this size especially in the east side and this is it for the video guys and that's how the job looks like i hope you guys enjoyed it we'll see you guys in the next video we have a few videos are done and ready to go it's just a matter of uploading it and kind of record the voiceover thank you guys for watching